today on Spice Box, I'm going to share with you how to make Indonesian Chinese style satay. So we're going to be making chicken satay with peanut sauce. Skinless, boneless chicken breasts are marinated in spices and then served along with a spicy peanut butter sauce. So let's get started. To begin with, we'll require chicken breasts that are boneless and skinless and then I've skewered them on a skewer like so. So this is about one breast, so we got four pieces. I'll require a third of a cup of coconut milk, a pinch of red chilli powder, a teaspoon of Chinese masala, salt to taste, about half a teaspoon of turmeric powder and I'll require a teaspoon each soy sauce and booster sauce, half a teaspoon of tamarind pulp, three tablespoons of peanut butter, the crunchy kind, you can buy it at the store ready-made or you could just blend some peanuts at home and you'll be able to make that. Curry powder will require half a teaspoon, white pepper powder, a fourth of a teaspoon, coriander powder, one teaspoon, minced garlic, about two teaspoons and some cucumber for garnish. We'll start by marinating our chicken breasts. So we're going to take the minced garlic. Next, we're going to add a little bit of the coriander powder, turmeric powder, white pepper powder, a little bit of the Chinese masala, some curry powder, the Worcestershire sauce and finally some soy sauce. We're going to add just a pinch of salt, not too much. Remember the soy sauce also has as well as the Worcestershire sauce and just massage this in and let this marinate for about half an hour in the refrigerator. Add the peanut butter because we're going to be making the peanut sauce. Next, we'll add a little bit of chili powder. This gives it just a little bit of heat. White pepper powder, which gives a wonderful smoky flavor. A little bit of sugar and some nice, well-minced garlic. Now mix all this. Then add your soy sauce. You'll require about a teaspoon or two. A little bit of the tamarind pulp to give a nice sour zing to it. Just gently mix everything in. And now we're going to add about a third of a cup of coconut milk. We'll start by heating our pan, a frying pan with a little bit of oil and our chicken that has been marinating for about half an hour, I'm just going to place it. Now remember this is boneless and skinless so it cooks fairly fast. Don't overcook it otherwise it will have a cardboard taste to it. Just let it become golden brown on each side. While the chicken is cooking I'm going to go ahead and set the garnish. Now traditionally in Indonesia this is served with cucumber slices and the satay sauce. I've put just a little bit of sesame seeds and I think they're done, perfect. Place them on your platter. Just look how beautiful that is. Garnish with a little bit of chili powder and you have an excellent starter that hardly took any time to make. 